So this screencast is going to show you how to edit and insert pictures into your Microsoft Word document. When you're making a portfolio, you don't want to just have a picture on one sheet and then have your user need to scroll all the way down to another sheet to find the words that go with the picture. So you want everything to be um, embedded into each other. So we're going to go to insert and I'm going to click on picture and say I have this sketch that I took from my notebook. Um, I took a picture of it and I uploaded it and now here's my, my one of my brainstorming sketches let's say. So right here this picture is looking a little funky. I can't really read most of it so I can go over here to corrections and you see I have all these different options. So here's some darker ones. That's not going to help me. What about like these brighter ones? I think this one makes it so that I can read the words a lot more. Um, it looks more black and white, which is um, something that I definitely want to see. So I have this picture, but now I try to move it, and you'll notice that um, my cursor gets this little weird um, box around it, and it won't be able to move. So what I have to do is right-click and go to Wrap Text down here. Now, all of these different options are what I have. Right now, I'm in, in line with text, so my text will only show up on top and on bottom. But I, I think square and tight are pretty um, pretty good options. Through will make your text go behind or in front of your picture, depending on if you choose behind or in front. So I would say maybe square or tight is a good choice. Now I can move this wherever I want. Um, I can also see like some extra space on the sides. I want my picture to be cropped exactly to just what I want to show. So I can go over to my right on the top bar and click crop. And now I get these weird little uh, brackets. And I can pull them in and wherever my shaded part is will get cut out. So I will only keep the part that's bright. So let's say that this is what I want. I'm going to click back on crop and all that other part goes away. So I have exactly what picture I want. Now I can type in my words. This is one of my brainstorming sketches showing blah, blah, blah. Okay, so you'll notice that the text is going to go around the picture. And if I move my picture over here, my text will move with it. So this is a way to make your portfolio look much, much more professional. Um, you're going to have your pictures embedded into your words, so um, you'll know exactly what picture you're talking about, and the words will flow perfectly with your um, sketches.